investigative treatment. Investigative treatment ensures focus on the selected event, and event treatment and system monitoring to investigate the source of the event can occur simultaneously. We have triggered several events. The beginning is the same as for the fast treatment, we switch to event handling. Another general rule. The unprocessed events with the highest priority appear at the top of the event list. We want to pay special attention to the open main power switch, select the relevant event and start the investigative treatment with this button in the event details. Below the summary bar, we have a new one, the investigative treatment bar, labeled accordingly. The investigative treatment bar remains a fixed part of the application screen until we close it. The investigative treatment bar shows the following information and has the following functions. The leave button allows to close or interrupt the investigative treatment. Symbol representation of the event by discipline and category. The event category flashes when the event source is unprocessed. It becomes solid color when the process of handling the event has been started. Indicates the event cause, date and time, and event source. Allows switching back to event list without interrupting the current investigation treatment. When in event handling, it allows switching back to system manager. Allows commanding the event by suggesting the next action or allows with the vertical ellipsis to select any offered commands. When this event mode is started in event handling, it causes the switch to the system manager and displays the source in the system browser and primary pane to allow further investigation, as seen here with our example. As a result of the open main switch of the main electrical supply, a fault has also occurred in the uninterruptible power supply. The main power switch object is a high alarm category and the summary bar shows us two unprocessed events as high alarm and three events in total. The investigative treatment bar gives us the possibility to switch between system manager and event handling by clicking on this button, show in events, when in the system manager and vice versa, using the button, show in system, when in event handling. The investigative treatment bar stays in the same place, and therefore we do not lose sight of this event treatment, until we leave it ourselves. Besides the leave button in the bar, this method can also be terminated in the event details with the same function. The investigative treatment allows us to handle another event in the event list, such as the thermoelectrical overload of the supply air fan, without influence or change on the investigative treatment. The high event lamp in the summary bar has changed to one unprocessed in a total of three events. We start with event handling and use the acknowledge option in the bar, since command execution is new in this location. In the investigative treatment bar, the alarm symbol no longer flashes, but is now a solid color. No further commanding options are displayed for event handling because the fault is not yet resolved, which is confirmed with the event state, waiting for condition, in the event details. The alarm is still selected in the event list and is now listed further down due to the acknowledgement. The high event lamp information in the summary bar has changed to zero unprocessed in a total of three events. Please note, during investigative treatment, a multi-selection and treatment of events in the event list is not supported. The next step is to troubleshoot the alarm in the field, which in our demo project example means going to the system manager and pushing the electrical alarm again and with this we close the main switch for the power supply again. Nothing has changed in the summary bar. The investigative treatment bar now shows us the next event treatment, the reset. At this point we have two options, leave the investigative treatment first and then reset the event, or reset first, to complete the event treatment. Ending or interrupting the investigative treatment can be done manually by using the two leave buttons in the bar or in event details. We would like to show you the possibility to reset first and, consequently, perform the reset in the bar. An investigative treatment pop-up appears and shows us that the event is no longer available and we are asked to continue with the investigation. Selecting No will complete the investigative treatment, 
cause the Flex client to return to event handling, and make the investigative treatment bar disappear. The high event lamp in the summary bar has been updated to a total of two events. Next, we would like to show you other features in the event treatment.